So what a tremendous idea we learned. The first year of Rosh Hashanah is a harsh judgment. The second one is a more lenient judgment. The difference between the two is somewhat complex and difficult to explain in brief. But let's try this way. It's extremely difficult to be successful when facing judgment. We beseech Hashem to remember Akedat Yitzchak and have the merit of our forefathers hold us up, because we on ourselves cannot possibly do so. On the second day, however, it is possible. What does that mean? On the first day, one's merits, all our positive and negative actions are judged. On the second day, one is judged according to how much the public needs them. There are some who will be granted life because they provide vital medical treatment for their patients, and others because they teach Torah or open and close the shul each day. There's also a group that shares in the merits of the public. We refer to these groups as Lezakot Tarabim or Zikui Harabim, bringing merit to the masses. Being a partner in an organization that facilitates a constant study of Torah or performing chesed is one such example. Many examples exist, often involving acts that you yourself do not know how to perform or are not able to execute, which can be achieved through the partnership with those who are capable. It's something to remember. But over the next few classes, we will explore something that will make your whole outlook on Rosh Hashanah completely changed. Stay tuned.